are playing in TV shows and film, did you film this movie simultaneously with Insecure? And there's a lot of Lawrence Hive <laughs> fans out there that want to know. They're like, okay, hold up. He's, he's, he's in theaters now. Shout out to the Lawrence Hive, first and <laughs> foremost. Uh, thank you guys for being members. Um, there's only one other hive in the world that you guys know of. <laughs> it's just me and B. We're the only two people with hives. Um, no, um, I did not. So we wrapped, uh, that would be season, we wrapped season two of Insecure, um, and then I left to Africa. We, we filmed this in South Africa, in Cape Town, so I left to Cape Town to go film this movie, uh, and then came back and um, did something else, and then production for Insecure started. So I, they weren't filming at the same time. And that wasn't the reason why Lawrence was gone. I mean, you kind of <laughs> threw us for a loop. We kind of thought like, okay, Issa's got these new love interests. He's not coming back. We kind of, you know, towards the last season. But you season, always want the old thing back, we had right? Carl Thomas, <laughs> uh, Turtle Neck on. <laughs> <laughs> but it's so, it's so cool to see your character return on that show and the growth that it's kind of had. Um, I mean, it's kind of had a savage year. Yeah, you know, we, um, I will say, you know, our Issa is seriously one of the most brilliant storytellers I've ever met. And uh, her um, drive and like quest to keep things honest and real um, is such an amazing quality. And, it, and it's, I think, why our show is so good and our writers really get to dive into that themselves. And it's not like, you know, they don't have to pull for story beats and storylines that they've never lived. Everyone gets to be a part of telling these people's stories and, and infusing their own lives and their own stories into each one of these characters. And so I think that's why, I hope that's why uh, people respond to it the way they do, because so you, you really feel something. Are you saying there are similarities between you and Lawrence? I am saying that there are similarities between my life <laughs> and a character's life on insecure but not necessarily <laughs> one so it's okay. kind of a mix where like you may come in and pitch a story and like that's not going to end up in your storyline it may end up in molly's storyline mm. or in Issa's storyline or in joe's storyline or daniel's storyline or uh, uh uh chad's storyline so what happens is it's kind of a mix right so i have told stories that have ended up on air but not necessarily uh-huh lawrence's so we gotta look out for that this coming season <laughs>